we implemented something immediately in Pipeliner where you can write an email and it helps you because salespeople are not so good in emails and in the in the grammar and everything. And so we implemented it in our product. But I, I think it's uh, there is a, a mixture on that because there is something like people don't like changes. Yeah. And when people don't like changes, they have fears. And many fears came up immediately because maybe I'm losing my job. And to be honest, yes, it will. Yeah, A lot of people will lose their jobs. Like for instance, in my opinion, what I can see, what AI can do today is parallels. I don't know if they are really necessary in the future. Yeah, um, And not only that um, many people have fears about losing their job, uh, so the connotation was a little bit negative. It was not positive. It was immediately to the discussion also that Elon Musk started about where it can go yeah, in the future. What I believe, what we have tested, and we were going really, really deep into that, it's far away. It's really very, very far away. Yeah. So the fears that has been spread out uh, led to the people, oh, it's uncontrollable. AI is uncontrollable. And, and one day um, AI will uh, make a decision for me that I don't like. Yeah. So come on. Or in my opinion, this is really off the cliff at the, what I can see technically at that moment. Could it go there one day in a couple of generations? Maybe. But look at this. Or I think... At the beginning of some of the industries, um, or, uh, maybe this is a good comparison. In the old days, or 100 years ago, we moved the body. First, we moved the body to the Iron Lady. Yeah? Or then we moved the body to the cars. And then we moved the bodies to airplanes. And maybe in the future, we moved the body to rockets that we are fast from one place to another. Right now, we can move our minds. And this is... What people are ex having anxieties and fears. And I strongly believe it's about the uncertainty. It's the uncertainty that's out there. And also that not a lot of people explain uh, what can happen. And think about of the air industry. Today, you cannot start your little airplane in the backyard of your house yeah, <laughs> and fly around in Los Angeles, for instance. There is rules and regulations that we have embedded on the airports and the airplanes and everything. And I think that is what needs to be done in the next 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 years. And then we have an industry that helps us. Mm -hmm. So I am more on the side on as a technology company, what can be done and not so much about the fear that is spreading out around. And I feel, wow, there is tremendous things that uh, I hope we can talk a lot um, mm -hmm. in the future, in, in, in these sessions later on. I am very, very positive about the stuff that can be done and not so much negative. Or, and we should take away, summarizing that, or, or away the fear of the uncontrollable, of, or, oh, my losing my job. No, maybe you can do something else or the uncertainty. And, hey, change is coming. We all have to change. Yeah. So let's, let's be open to that. <laughs>